Hello, Monsters of Man here, welcome back to Total War Warhammer 2 Mortal Empires and part 17 now firing campaign. Well, we're close to victory, but can we win? I mean, the answer is yes, we can. Just will it be today or will it be tomorrow or the day after? It'll be one of those. I've set my garrison boys. So they, they mostly died that, that, that. Now that was a dive. I saw that. Everyone saw that. He dived. Um, Grom rampaging into a bunch of other... Yep, that seems to be going okay. We're just going to fill him full of uh, full of arrows there. C can we catch him? Because... You know, we've been trying to catch old Grom for quite a while. But this battle is going to be tough. Because they are bringing a lot of, a lot of Black Orcs to the party. You know what? I've decided that we... It's, he's just not dying that quickly. It's fine. We'll, um, we'll get him next time. We'll get him next time. We're corner camping because it's just a lot of orcs, to be honest. There's a lot of orcs about. Um, maybe if I'd waited, we'd get Grom. He's, the thing is, he's on a chariot, so he's pretty pretty speedy. He's got, he's got, got some speed on him, so he can get away from our st normal, totally normal dungeon. However, the corner camping is really confusing the orc ball boys, who can't decide whether they should just charge us. And that's what they're doing. They're going to charge straight into Lothan Sea Guard, which is going to do absolutely no damage. And then they're going to take an absolute beating in return, because, of course, we're anti-large. Now Tharion just flapping about in the centre there. And this, we never got more... We still haven't got more Sisters of Avalon. I, I'm close to getting more, just didn't build the building. Um, it's fine. Don't really need them. I mean, it'd be nice, don't get me wrong, but whatever. Tharion's landed in amongst the, this Arachnorok spider to give them a little, little hug. A little hug for the Arachnorok spider. And of course, there's plenty of Black Orcs around. Fucking Black Orcs. So many Black Orcs. Endless fucking Black Orcs. I'm so sick of fighting Greenskins. Why is it all my campaigns end up fighting endless either Dwarves or Greenskins? It's one or the other. Or occasionally Empire. Just endless them. Oh well. Little little vortexy thingy there. Just going to clear off those. Uh, well, mostly night. Go I was hoping to kill mostly the black orcs, but it, it killed mostly the night goblin archers. That's fine. Uh, the front line is holding. Uh, we're trying to sort of reinforce it with the knights of Torgaval. Because if we leave the black orcs just chunking their way through the Lothan Sea Guard, the Lothan Sea Guard don't do very well. Turns out their frail elf bodies just. Just split asunder when hit by a double-handed axe. Ugh. Unbelievable. So you can see the Knights of Torquevale just landing in amongst there, just trying to break those Black Orcs before they do too much damage. They've already killed 14. Sisters of Avalon picking off that Arachnorok Spider. Eltharion is actually in a bit of trouble here. He's taking a lot of damage, and he needs to get out of there quickly. He's, he's, he's under... Ooh, he's down to under... I mean... All the arrows probably didn't help, but dropping a comet certainly did, and he's going to get out of there and probably just retire behind the lines to safety. The enemy reinforcements are on their way, but haven't arrived yet, and this, the initial force is mostly dealt with. We dealt with most of the frontline forces, some of the uh, Savage Orc, or, um, sorry, Orc War Boys, still running into our our formation, but we should be okay. Here we've got the Helm of Yavresi, so our entities cannot die while the ability is active. That's right. No matter the terrible injuries they suffer, they'll still be alive. Wishing for death. The main thing is, though, they'll hold the line for our Sisters of Avalon to... Oh, well, they're actually being attacked by some... That's fine. They'll, they'll be okay. And they're doing a lot of damage there with their fireworks. Obviously, don't go back to a firework once it's been lit. That's, that's key. Or once it's embedded in the forehead of an orc. That's also fairly key. Okay, the front line held. We still have ammunition, which is good. And of course, I think we have the, uh, the unending volley. So basically, you just get more ammunition every 16 seconds or so, I think it is. Which is, you know, quite nice. Basically, means you never run out of arrows. Which is good. Take out the loss of those orc boar boys. And the rest of them just sort of like rolling out. Oh, it's like they're chasing Yen. They're after Yen. Yen is making a beeline for the enemy reinforcements to do some finger waggling. A little, a little bit of magic. Just 
to all the fucking black orcs they brought to the party. Because, you know, why else would you bring anything else? Oh, that's not bad. It's doing a lot of damage. Uh, it's not doing many kills. But, you know, the damage is definitely there. I mean, Yen is racking up the damage points, I believe. If we have a look at uh, old Yen there, we can see that, uh, yeah, the damage value climbing very rapidly as it carves its way through those units. Getting quite a few kills as it goes through the goblins. So far, so good. Did a little bit of damage to that army. And the Knights of Torquevar now moving in to give us a little bit of support. I mean, they can't have many more armies, can they? In theory. I mean, I've killed so many of them. They must run out at some point. They just can't keep recruiting Black Orcs left, right and centre. Can they? Can they? They can, can't they? Oh, they can. It's going to be Black Orcs forever. Ugh. Oh, well. At least I don't have shields. Which is good, because, you know, I've only got archers. It's just killing them all before they reach us. That's that's the real key. Uh, the old biggins there taking a deluge of fire from the Sisters of Avalon. Really should have focused. I should have got more Sisters of Avalon. And we're going to try and drop another comet on these Black Orcs. How's that going to go? It looks like they are darting away. And they do create a little... Yeah, it, it doesn't catch many of them. They managed to get away. Um, and it also looks like a Colossal Squig is attacking, attacking Cavill there. He's fine, though. He'll be all right. So the Black Orcs have taken a bit of damage as they advance on our front line. And it looks like... Oh, shit. Look. Army losses starting to take effect as a mass rout seems to be happening. And the Black Orcs actually break and run before they reach our line, which is, you know, my preference. I would prefer them to retreat. Uh, I mean, it would be nice if they got a little bit closer first and then ran away, give me more opportunity to shoot them, but that's fine. I'll, I'll take what I can get. Got them. And I know that looked one-sided, but it's it's basically a case of either we kill them before they reach our front line, or our front line dies horribly. So, uh... Yes. Do not bend. No. No. It's true. Now, um, so... I can't believe they've got more fucking stacks. So I've, I've killed so many of them, and I cannot believe they've got yet more of the bastards. With Sporticuses, and they've got another stack up there as well. Whoa, that's a lot of rats. Probably a lot of clan rats, though, so... Just because they, it looks like they attacked Hackendorf and lost. Be sure you do not waste my time. Hello, bandage boy. Non-aggression pact. I am not going to give you any money. Not today, not ever. Okay, Grom might retreat towards Barakvar, and if he does, I won't be able to catch him. Uh, but that's not the end of the world. And we need to get Imerick to get down here to deal... Oh no, is Alice going down? I can't remember who I'm being... I think Imerick's going down to deal with the, um, the Marshes of Madness. Yes. Yes, he is. So he's he's going to go and deal with that. We're going to go and bot Grom. Failure. I could have locked him up, but I genuinely can't be asked. Their only worth is service. Another God, they have a lot of strange incidents. Uh, I don't really want to take attrition damage if I can. It is it's just, one. just camp up. What is it? Is it chaos corruption? It is chaos corruption. He's going down by four percent, so I'm hoping that uh, that won't be a problem for too much longer. Uh, meanwhile, let's bring Alice north. And we'll send Imerick south and heal you up. There we go. We need defences everywhere. Because God knows where all these stacks of green skins are coming from. See, that's another stack. They had two stacks and then that stack. And then God knows how many other more stacks. I'm getting a little bit bored of killing green skins. I'll, I'll level with you. Uh, let's... No, that's not actually useful, is it? Well, that's not true, because we do have Lothurn Sea Guards. We do have Lothurn Sea Guards. We could replace them with... 
spire guards who would be better, right? These guys do have 44 missile strength, and we could replace them with sentinels of a Doobie What's It. They f well, yeah, no, we could. Because they're just better, right? They've got more defense, less. You got 29, 15. F okay, so you. Okay, yeah, all right. This is what we're going to do. We're going to fire you lot. Remain vigilant. And you. Never falter. Why can't I recruit more of them? It says 5 of 14. That says four available? What? Okay. All right. Well, uh, we'll, we'll just go with that then. Fine. Whatever. Prince I'm fairly sure I should be able to... It doesn't seem like that should be a cooldown, but maybe I'm looking at it wrong. No, it says... Okay, zero. All right. I thought it said like four. Duty. My bad. My bad. Numbers. It's a blind spot. Anyway, anyway, right. Well, okay. So we need to take these ones. We're, we're fairly close to victory now, I think. You can be hard to hit for no particular reason. Uh, you... Right. You're a long way from home. I can relate. Am I? I mean, I, I have home. I have I have left. I've, I've gone so I've gone on a little vacation, but I'm not that far away. The true lines? No? Okay. Well, what, what, what about... That a hunter does not understand negotiation. You're at minus 357. Really? No. I don't... I don't... I don't understand, Marcus. God, the AI is such a dick. I really hate these guys. Are you going to declare war on them? Nah. Nah. I've got the armies. I do have the time. I've got the money. I've got the resources. But nah, I'm, I'm okay, actually. Thanks very much. I'm just going to... Just going to chill here, actually. Fucking... Ooh. Ooh. Hello. The fuck is that? A scurvy land ship. My prowess is Uh Guess I'll just kill you then. Deep cleaner. Oh, that was Throt. <laughs> Didn't even realize. <laughs> oh, oh Throt, what are you doing down here, buddy? Holy shit. No weakness. I kind of just want to see what that is, but um no rest for the wicked. Because we've got to go and do some more damage to some more settlements. Because otherwise, who's here? Is this? Oh, it's you guys. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm just going to occupy this. It's Clan Scurvy. That is absolutely fine and dandy. Is there only vengeance? Well, yes. Because otherwise you'd be at sea, wouldn't you? That would be silly. Oh, Jesus Christ. Guys. Calm the fuck down with your goddamn ludicrous naked orc party. I swear to God. I swear to God. Right, okay. Let's go with... Uh, I guess I guess that one. I don't really care, to be honest. Yeah, and you've got all the skill points. So I'm going to give you the Thunderbolt because it's something... Well, it's one, it's very, very frightening and the other is that it's the skill point you don't have. So get that one, I guess. Uh, you are all finished, which is fine. You have some growth to go. Okay, good. You can shape your world with some salt. Do that one. Still technology, sure. Uh, I could repair that, but you're probably going to get damaged again. We've got low fun. Oh, shit. Yeah, we have low funds. <laughs> Noted. Also, you're fired. I haven't been paying attention to my buddies. You're fired. You're fired. You're fired. You're fired. You're fired. Right, 6k. That's slightly better. Fuck, what happened to the money? Need the Western Badlands. What don't we have? Uh oh, Stone Mine Tower. Stone Mine Tower? So, yeah, okay. We need to we need to grab Stone Mine Tower. 
let's get rid of you. Not one rookie on Nagarith. That means we can survive at least one more turn. No glory. Only However, that's not great. I need four more settlements. Four more settlements, the Marshes of Madness, and Stonemine Tower. That's all we need. Seems a bit pedantic, but there we go. I, I don't know what happened to my indoctrination. <laughs> like, I'm suddenly poor. I didn't realise. Last time I checked, I was fine. I don't, I'm don't. i rich. I don't look at money. And now suddenly I'm poor again. What happened? Oh. Oh. It's the revenue. They're after me. No, I'm not giving you money. I don't have any money. I'm losing money. I'm hemorrhaging money. Holy fuck. Just so much money I don't have suddenly. <laughs> Oh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Look, they've still got more stacks. Just hundreds of fucking stacks of green skins all over the place. And they don't even that many they don't even have that many settlements anymore. I've taken most of them. Good grief. Oof. 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 Oh, oh for oh for fuck oh god. Uh can we just win this? I'll yeah, win. okay, good. I always do. Good. Yeah. Also take the money because we need it. Shake out their pockets. They don't have any pockets, they're naked. But, I don't know. Cavity search them. Anything. I don't care. It's not me doing it. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. This is fine. Right, we're going to take the Flame Village. We're going to loot and occupy for a little bit of money. And this is very much a case of, hmm, um, what, what can we make here? Realm. Okay, we're going to grab Stone Mine Tower. Come on, hurry up. Uh, yep, yeah, colonize. Good. Prince and I'm going to go and take Iron Rock. Oh, you're going to kill the kitty cats. Oh, you know what? That's fine. I'm not that invested. Right, loot and occupy, boys. Loot and occupy. We're poor. We need money. Smash the poor people. That's what rich people do when you need money. So, well, uh, okay. Let's... I guess... Mm, uh, mm, what should I give you? Tempest? It's kind of garbage. I guess I'll give you that because it's about the only thing I can think no, of. No failure. The kitties are dead, but they were living on borrowed time anyway. Let's be honest. Yeah, I know he's he's a he's raging. He's absolutely raging. Okay, so that means we aren't, right. Do we just need one more settlement? So tick, tick, tick. T yeah, okay. We just need one more, <laughs> one more settlement, boys and girls. One more fucking settlement is all we need. Um, as long as we can maintain what we already have. Uh, Morkheim is not a happy boy. Rebellion in two turns. Uh, is that fine apart from conquest? Conquest and corruption. Emmerich. Merchant Lords. Hopefully that'll give us some more... Is it... Um, okay. It, it, you know, it's, it's, it's fine. It's, uh, it's okay. Is there anyone who... Ooh. Require assistance. Very well. Speak if you must. All right. Thank you. Anyone else who Good will... Rug. Hello. Greetings, honourable ally. Yes. Good. You've come back, haven't you? Okay. Um. That it, it's still it's still not it's it's not great. But but as long as uh, is there a public order built? Uh, one. Hang on. Da, 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 no. It's a tax rate one. Am I still? My plan is yeah. Okay. Well. I can do that. That'll that'll give us a little bit more cash there. Let's get a little bit more cash there. And with any luck, we won't run out of money before... Uh... Oh, what about... Do we have any... Hello, public order plus four. Bosh. That cost me money, didn't it? Oops. How much money? Uh, it's still fine. This will be okay. Uh, we can actually untax that, couldn't we? It's only bringing 299. That's not really going to change change my life. So um, so we'll go with that. I mean, so far, so good. This might be a bit of a short episode because I'm hoping to sort of like grab Karagdron 
or something. But you know, if episodes are short, that's that's um that that's that's well, it's your problem, really. Hooray! Okay, uh, might, we might be like a couple of turns away. Um, as long as we can maintain our hold, we should be fine. Public order is increasing. There we do have, though, clan moors. But they are several turns away, so we should be okay as we head towards victory. Victory's Karagdrona, for fuck's sake. Of course Grom's there. He would be, wouldn't he? The big fat bastard. Okay, we're going to head this way. There we go, and I think we're apart from that, apart from we do, they're a couple of turns away, that's fine, as long as we can hold on to it, it's, uh, it's okay. And oh, for bollocks sake! Who let Marathi in? I mean, I, I think, <laughs> I think we should be fine, <laughs> apart from the fact we're going to go bankrupt in two turns, unless I get rid of an army. Uh, am I taxing everything? I often forget to tax things. I should check. <laughs> I'm fairly sure people would have said something before now. Um, but, you know, you know, I guess it's going to be the last battle, isn't it? So um, let's see if we can finally, finally get Grom in the old sex dungeon. I mean, not normal, totally normal. It's a, it's, oh, it's a sex dungeon. You know it is. Seems we're heading towards victory very quickly. Let's see if we can lock Grom up because, you know, we haven't successfully done that yet. And it would be a nice way to round the campaign off. Getting, getting the old, the old nemesis. That's right. See, Altharian's very excited about this because he's already done Elfspunk all over him. So, so there we go. And uh, he's going to first go and deal with the, uh, the flanking units. And then we're going to concentrate on dealing with Grom. He's charging straight into our front line of spire guards, and yep, yeah, getting yep. Yeah, Eltharion comes in right from behind, taking him, taking him in the posterior. We're going to do a lot of damage to him very quickly, and as soon as it looks like he's going down, we're going to lock him up in our sex dungeon. It's a sex, it's a sex dungeon. It's just a sex dungeon. Let's, let's be honest. It's uh, you know what it is. We know what it is. Everyone knows what it is. No point beating around the bush, which is exactly what goes on in the dungeon. So. So that's sinking. And uh, Grom is he's down to very low health. He's taking a beating. He's always down. Are we going to get him? Are we going to get him? Are we going to get him? He's, yeah, he's down. He's in. Yeah, we got him. We got him. We got him, ladies and gentlemen. Mission completes. Cavill is uh, busy with some Black Orcs there. So let's help him out with uh, a little, little magic. little magical support. We'll drop a comment on his head. He's fine. He'll be all right. He'll walk that off. Oh, God. Overshot that, didn't I? Jesus. Right. The Knights of Torquaval are dealing with uh, some Black Orcs who are again getting shot in the flank by the Sentinels of Asteri. Asteril? That's the one. This force is much smaller than the one we've had to deal with. Oh, God. Cavill, you're fighting a whole horde of swamp trolls. Are you okay there, buddy? You're all right. You got this. I believe in you. Oh, they just threw up all over him. That's nasty. That's nasty. Fine, the Sisters of Avalon have, have noticed and are going to help him out. There we go. He should be fine, probably. Just dodge, dodge and weave, mate. You're fine. You'll be all right. Altharian is having having locked Grom up in his, in his secret... I mean, it's not really a secret, is it? It's sex dungeon. He's now mopping up the last remnants of the Orc forces. We do have reinforcements of, you know, Black Orcs, of course. It's, it's pretty much standard these days. Just a horde of fucking Black Orcs coming straight towards us. But victory is pretty much assured. With Grom down. And just some Blackhawks slowly trudging towards our formation. Very slowly. You know, they're big, they're big chunky boys. They're not going to go anywhere fast, are they? And uh, that doesn't really help when you don't have shields or any other army support. Yeah, like those, those guys. See, those guys didn't have a nice time. Looks like uh, army losses starting to take effect on the initial army. I don't imagine that the reinforcements will stick around for too much longer. Nice little vortex spell coming in there, doing some good damage against those black orcs. Really just carving straight through that formation. Oh, very nice.
Yen, of course, a stalwart of the campaign, has been uh, just doing some really good shit. Cavill, you know, tanking everything with his face. What a guy. This unit of Spire Guards, pretty much dead, but that's fine. And army loss is now taking effect. The Black Orcs retreating before they get, well, too close. Apart from these Spire Guards who maybe get a whack in the face before the Black Orcs. Turn and run. Heat up the nipple clamps, boys. We're going to need the extra large ones. Finally, we got Grom. Can't believe it. It took us the entire campaign. <laughs> but we got him. We got the bugger. There he is, all locked up. He's a bit skinny there. Doesn't matter. It's probably fine. Uh, okay, we don't, we don't have to worry about the Warriors of Chaos. Those guys are just not, not a problem. Uh, that is also not our problem. Because I don't need that settlement. We've got all the settlements we need. God, I hope Warhammer 3 brings in some some decent victory conditions. Because I mean, like with the big map, obviously, like the, the actual campaign is going to have its own victory, sort of like the Vortex campaign does. But uh, I really do hope that it's not just captured these settlements because it's just. What do you want? I, did, did I have a non? I didn't even realise I had a non-aggression pact with you. To be honest, that's a bit of a surprise. I'm a little bit shocked, but that's fine, I guess. Okay, okay, good, good. That one's been raised. It's not our problem. That is, um, can I not, okay, if I attack you. Uh-huh. Okay, there we go. Another strange incident. Wow, they're just very... Very strange. Ah, uh, Lockheed Pike, doesn't really matter. Is that, is that all we need? Uh, cause that won't fire until next turn, will it? That's, that's the slight issue. I think we should be okay though. I don't think they can take anything. They can't reach that. That's okay. Don't have to worry about that. That's fine. Uh, Marathi. Where's Marathi? Okay, she's gone the other direction, so that's okay. Wow, there's a lot of Marathi there. Um, how the fuck has she got that much stuff? And Tyrion, what are you doing? How has she got three stacks? How has she got three? Why do you just have spearmen, you lunatic? Go recruit some decent units. You... Oh, never mind. I don't think we have to do much more, to be honest. Uh, Yen, you've been an absolute stalwart throughout the campaign. What a girl. Sorry, lady. Um, Cavill, as always. What a guy. Uh, level, I mean, he's level 40. 70, 70, 5, 4, 7. What? I mean, look at that. He's just face tanked everything. He's... Uh, could have done it without him. Let's put it that way. Definitely couldn't have done it without him. Yeah, I don't really care about that. It's a lot of Doom Wheels, though. Like, that's a lot of that's a lot of Doom Wheels. I need to calm down on the Doom Wheels, mate. They're very, very intense in this campaign, aren't they? Very, very focused on just recruiting the maximum amount of bullshit and throwing it at you. I'm so sick of face <laughs> facing fucking Black Hawks. Oh, oh there's so many, so many Black Hawks. Just endless waves of... I think that's what gets me. It's just the, the sheer sort of like endless waves of Black Hawks they can throw at you. You know, entire stacks of the buggers. It's just like... Oh. It's just kind of exhausting to deal with. And the problem is that, you know, I, I've, I've spent a lot of the battle just shooting at them before they arrive. And that's because that's really efficient. And you have to be efficient because if they can throw that many armies at you... You have to pick the army that's going to be able to wipe out multiple stacks. And there we go. Oh, mighty lord. The fates yes. have surely selected you for greatness. Yeah, I know. Thanks to my guidance. No. You're... Get the fuck out of here. Right, okay, well there we go. A victory. Uh we, we had to flee from the Badlands, but you know, we got we got back there eventually. So that's good. And uh eventually won the campaign. Although having the the, the chapter 
completions being the thing holding me back was a bit weird because it almost never happens. Um, but we just haven't captured that many settlements because we haven't needed to. Which is fine, I guess. But there we go. Elthara incomplete. Next, I'm going to be playing some Beast Men because I feel like it. And, well, it's my YouTube channel. If you don't like that, then make your own YouTube channel and do it yourself. But until then, thank you very much for watching. And uh, I'll see you next time.